Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48. We're going to be taking a look at a new game called Winter Survival Prologue. Experience survival under harsh winter conditions and our sanity system and see what happened before the events of Winter Survival take place. So I actually played this game, I don't know, like a year ago maybe? And I, I think it was called Winter Survival Simulator. So I'm not really sure what this is all about. Um, we're going to go ahead and start a new game. And we're going to choose Medium. Because I like my medium difficulty. I'm going to see what this game's all about. Play it for... Okay. Oh, hold on. Just breathe. Are you hurt? No. Good. Remember the cave? Go there and hide. I'm going to look for Mike. No way. I'll never get there alone. You will. Just keep the radio on. I'll tell you what to do. Okay, sounds good to me. Go through the bushes. I can do that. Um. Oh, yep, yep. Got to jump up here. And you got to duck. Wait. Let them pass. I'll give you a signal. Expect to see me get eaten by wolves quite often? Because I'm not very good at this. You know what to do. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Can't sprint yet either. Alright. We're avoiding the wolves quite nicely. Those bastards are blocking the path. Distract them. See that crow over there? Try to scare it away. Um, hold T to focus. Yep, okay. Very good. Um, snowballs doesn't attract attention on its own. Okay, so pick up some snow. Make a little snowball. It's a good time for a snowball fight. And we're going to get the crow to fly off. And that will uh, get the wolves to go do their thing. Alright. And we made it to... Mm, they sound close. They're starting to see me. Um, wait, what? Carry on unseen. Okay, well I screwed that up. There's nothing I can use to distract them. Shh. Yep, there we go. I was waiting for that. <laughs> A lot of times I end up not seeing the uh, wolves until it's too late. Climb the ledge. Okay. Yep, okay, this is, we gotta do that whole thing over again. Alright. Nope, oh, no. Hold on. Shit, I can't. You have to. So I thought I was gonna have to do that whole thing over again because I saw the ledge, but no, I made it through. I made it through. They have, like, checkpoints and stuff, so if you fail, you don't have to, like, do the same thing over and over and over. Uh, sprint, sprint, sprint. Now I can sprint, guys. They let me sprint, finally. Right. Suck on that, wolves. Hey, you like me now. Joel? I can't hear you. Joel? Okay. First drink something, then think. Okay, drink, then think. Got it. So here's my canteen. I'm going to drag that into the number one spot. And there's some water over here. Let's go ahead and uh, fill this bad mamma jamma up. Well, I guess I'm drinking first, but... Great. It's empty. There we go. It's fine. It's not empty for long. Huh? Man. <laughs> Very good. Sorry. I think I'm still in stealth mode. I need to catch my breath. Yeah, you do. What about Mike? Can't see anything in this weather. We need to wait till morning. Okay. okay. So, then what? We need to rest. And eat. Right. Fire. I can make a fire. You taught me how. Great. Make it somewhere nearby. And check my backpack. The rest should be just lying around. That guy sounds like such a clown. Like, 
I can make a fire. You taught me how. Like, freaking guy. I think that's enough. Yep, that is enough. Um, I craft campfire. There we go. Got a nice little campfire going in my inventory. All right, you know the thing. We put fuel up here, we light it up down here, we put food in there. Consumables, put a, I'm gonna put a sausage in there. Um, it's already got fuel, so let's light it up. Wow, he's pretty good at that. That feels good. Yeah. I'm starving. Not long now. Why, is it done yet? Have a nice... Shit, hide. Oh boy. Get in here. Oh, well, don't worry, I will. One thing this game does really well is immersion. Look at him, he's like, I'm gonna eat your meat, bro. What are you gonna do about it? Oh, uh, we're not gonna do a darn thing. We can come out now. Okay, good. Which he did burned he himself. These footprints. What the hell did he eat to grow this big? Other bears. People. Bears don't eat people, right? Um. Did you ever see the edge? All right. So the reason I only put one sausage on there was for this very reason. Disgusting. Not that we have anything better. Yeah. Mm. So we got meat scraps is what he left behind, but I saved the other meat. I did play this. Um, I did play this demo all the way through. It's a really fun demo. Like I was playing it and playing it, and playing it. Next thing I knew, it was over, and I'm like, wow, I must have really enjoyed it. What about Mike? Don't worry, we'll find him too. Hold on, man. Sausage almost done. Any second now. Oh, it's always meat scraps. I thought meat scraps was because that was what was left over from the bear. Okay, well, so be it. I tried. Place a sleeping bag on the ground. All right, so he's going to stand guard while I sleep. I like that idea. That's a good idea. All right, and let's go to sleep. Ah, good sleep. There's worse places to be caught than a cave. It's going to be fine. Give me a break. I'll, I'll be back soon, okay? Come on, guys, wake up. <sighs> Shit, we're late. There's the bus. Danny, run! Wake up. Run! Freaking bear, man. Just mind your own beeswax, punk ass bear. So this isn't looking good. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to jump. My canteen! <laughs> this guy would have been so dead. Now I need to feel my fingers. My new quest is to survive. I have to call him. Shit, I lost my gear. Hot springs. I need to get there. It's pointless. My fingers are frozen stiff. I can't go this way. Hmm. I'm just going where the little arrows tell me to go. What the? Oh, wolves. This is going to get a little dark for you guys because I have to turn off the, um, the light in order to deer the wolves. As a matter of fact, oh, I think I'm just about to get killed. He's dead. Oh, hold on, hold on. I think we're okay now. 
Do I gotta go over there? That's exactly where that wolf was. I don't see any more bushes over there either. Yeah, I think this guy's about to get me. Alright, let's run this way. Oh boy. Let's run this way. I'm just running to where the arrow is. Oh, here we go. Don't think about it. Just go. Why do I have multiple arrows now? I'm not sure where to go. <laughs> oh, the wolves. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna keep running until I either die or run out of stamina. Finally. There we go. So these things will warm you up. There we go. Man, his hands are in bad shape, dude. They're not just frostbitten, they're all torn up. It's good to be warm. It's making my hands hurt. Did you hear me crack my knuckles just now? No, no, no. Run! Run where? Oh, that way. Man, these freaking wolves, dude. I wonder if they were actually there. They might not have been there. I'll explain later. Might have been a... Darn it! I thought you could actually make it across that if you do it right. Because when I when I was playing my test game, I like I ran off the edge because I was panicking, and I was thinking next time I run this, I'm gonna make sure I do it right. All right, so you see he hallucinate a little bit, and that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking maybe that when there was like five, six wolves behind me, I was thinking maybe they weren't there. Because you see the big brain thing on the left hand, bottom left-hand side of my screen? That's like saying I'm going insane, basically. It's like an insanity or sanity mechanic or whatever. Alright, I'm just going to take everything that's not nailed down. Oh, leg. Yeah, that's right, my leg. Much better. There we go. And we can check the one up top. Let's see. Still... This cold is killing me. I know the cold is killing you, but let's, uh, let's loot first. Alright, so start a fire. No problem. Can do. Can I burn a wooden cup? Yes, I can. Right, every little bit counts, right? There Joel, we go. I hope you found Mike. Can't look for them right now. I'm too tired. I wish I could climb that. All right, let's go sleep. This fucking trip. this trip. Stop cursing, bro. YouTube don't like it. Click, 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 click. So this is part of the sanity mechanic they're going to talk about. All debuffs have negative, uh, negatively affected stats can low and negatively affected stats can lower your sanity. When your mind or body suffers, a sanity timer appears as a circle around the, the debuff or affected stat, thirst, hunger, energy, and temperature. If you don't do something about the sanity timer, it will run out. Each time this happens, your brain is affected and your sanity suffers. And it will keep happening until you get rid of the debuff or, or improve the negative stat. Eventually, your brain will be filled to 100%. It means that your brain can't take more trauma. And it will manifest itself in a new symptom. You'll have to choose the next time. You'll have to choose it the next time you go to sleep. So there's two symptoms. I could choose to see animals that aren't there. Or to see, like, rocks and stuff that aren't there. So I'm going to choose that one. Seems a little bit better. That way I know if I see an animal, it's real. Where's the arrow? There it is. All right. Am I really seeing those things? Oh, so there wasn't a gate there. <laughs> All right, fair enough. Oh, here we go with the slide. Wee! I'm wondering if that's real too. Yeah, it is. <laughs> There's my canteen. I should find fresh water. I also got to put that back in number one. There is plenty of snow around here. I'm not boiling snow. Water's better for you. So I should be able to get back up here by going to the right. There's the slide to the left and there's the way up to the right. 
And... What was that? Whoa. See, now that would have been bad if I tried to climb up that thing. And it wasn't actually there. <laughs> Ooh, bear tracks. Uh, let's get some water first. Give me that sweet, sweet nectar. Alright, then I'll just look up and drink until I'm full. Time to find something to drink. There we go. Perfectly hydrated. Let's drink a little bit more, shall we? I'm getting a little chilly. And then we're gonna fill this up again. I think you get wet when you fill that up, probably. Alright. So let's come on down here. And let's see what this is all about. Bear tracks and footprints next to it. It doesn't look good. I have to check it out. All right, so we will check that out. You can press Q for survival instincts, which shows you stuff that you could do. Like I could pick this stuff, pick this tall grass. Maybe do something with this. Get some oysters. Wait, did that say? Oh, oyster mushrooms. Okay, I was going to say oysters. That doesn't seem right. Anyway, we're going to follow the bear tracks up here. Worse. I hope the guys are okay. And we're going to try and warm up a little bit. There we go. So all our stats are looking okay right now. I'm going to grab some rocks from this rock pile. And it looks like the bear still in there? chased the guy to this cabin. And we're going to come in here and take everything we can out of this cabin. Need to find a way out. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Shut up. Damn it. Shut up up there. Oh, look at all this stuff. I didn't get this stuff last time I was here. I didn't know you could open these. Lots of smokes. I'm sure that would help your sanity. Oh, I'm encumbered. I didn't know that could actually happen. Should probably drop some stuff off. Let's get rid of the old toys. And... I don't know if a broken milk container is going to help that much. Hmm... There we go. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. That axe. Maybe I can get it out. Can't open the door, you're gonna need the axe to open the door. If he hears this, I'm fucked. And this axe is really weak, so it's gonna break as soon as the door's open. Um tip you can use the axe. Might still be here. Yeah, maybe. Uh, let me see if I can find some sticks so I can make another axe. Will this give me sticks? Yes, yeah, so it will. Uh, well, branches. I don't think that's what I need. Let me let me take a look. I honestly don't remember what it takes to make the axe. I know I need to make some rope, which means we're going to need more of those things. But, uh, yeah, actually, I do have the... Okay. So, we need to do is find some more... I'm not seeing it. All right, I'll find some more as we go along. Am I supposed to be following these footsteps? I don't know. Eh, yeah, whatever. We'll give it a shot. Where is the bushes that I need? Oh, those are blueberry bushes. There should be some regular bushes. Oh, here they are. I think. Nope. Maybe not. So even being encumbered was was causing me issues. Um, there they are. Okay, good. This is what I want. I uh, I dropped some broken bowls or something. So encumbered. Uh, really, I'm encumbered again. No, I'm 38 to 40. I'm not encumbered. You lying game. All right, I'm gonna ignore that. Let's go ahead and make some rope. And make an axe. And we'll put the axes number two. All right, cool. So let's uh, follow this hand. We gotta get our backpack. And Better there it is. Danny, can you hear me? 
Joel! Oh. No, no! Huh. Danny! Dude. So that thing fell down a cliff, <laughs> or like a big like cliff somewhere. I can't get it. I'm gonna grab my bag, and then I'm gonna come over here and show you. It fell down that, so I can't get it. No way I can get it now. There you go. See. Thanks for backing me up, bro. Okay, what's next? I don't know, honestly. All right, let's come down here. Um, should I go take a nap? Yeah, maybe. Oh, let's go to that eye. Yeah. Always go to the eye thing. So we're just gonna have to climb back up here, make a left, and go to the eye thing. Oh, got no stamina. I'm doing alright. I think I'm doing alright, all things considered. This is not an easy environment to, uh, you know, survive in. This game's hella immersive, though, man. Like, really... Really immersive. I do appreciate that. It's not like one of the things that I really look for in a survival game, but when it's there, I do enjoy it. Come on, just let me run, you douche. I should get some rest. Um, wait, what? Oh, I actually have to use it? Okay. Is that it? I'm not really sure what's going on here, but maybe you have to actually look at the. Yeah, I don't know. They want me to go across. They want me to look at this bridge. Here. Could have been either Joel or Mike. Whoever it was, I hope they're safe. But now, the bridge doesn't look very stable. I'll find a way. One step at a time. Oh, I'm hungry. The dead deer I saw. Maybe there's still some meat left on it. That would be a good thing to check on. I should eat something small first. Alright, I can eat something small. Uh, yeah, there you go. Alright, let's go check on that deer. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sliding all over the place. Nope, that's not the way. That's not is not the way to go. Um, <laughs> how do I get down there? Can I get down this way? Um, probably not. But what the heck? Let's give it a shot. You only live once. Ah, perfect. Well, you know what? Now I got something to do with my bandages. There you go. All right, let's check out that deer carcass. And it's gone. What the hell? It didn't walk away on its own. Did it? Or did it? I don't know if chasing down this deer carcass, whatever dragged it away, do you really want to tangle with? You know, I think I do. Uh, where do we got to go now? I guess we just got to keep following the, the blood trail. And here are the wolves. Yep. So we're going to grab some rocks. We're going to put the rocks as number three. And we are going to throw them at the bird up there once he lands. Go get him, boy. Go get him. These wolves are so adorable. Yeah, wolves took it. You got that right. I need to go slow. So there's a wolf right there. Doesn't seem like the light really does anything to them. I thought the light would like kind of wake them up. But now normally I wouldn't use the light, but I'm trying to make a let's play here and I want you guys to be able to see. We're okay. Just fine. No, we're not. <laughs> okay, well, there you go, guys. Lesson learned. The light does matter. Well, you know what? We don't have to guess. Okay. Come on, land, you stupid bird. There you go. Go get him. 
Go get him. Okay, well, now I know. I need to go slow. Yeah, go slow, bro. You're not gonna wake these guys up as long as you don't have your light on. You gotta thread the needle right here. Slippery. So we're gonna go this way. Shh. The problem is now that you have meat, they're gonna smell it. Mm. Okay. So far, so good. some loot here some loot there's quite a bit of loot in this cave I'm probably not gonna grab most of it because I'm already weighed down but just so you know there is loot you can get up there as well oh! grab 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 light 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 get out of here Go away! I don't know why I'm swimming, swinging in slow motion. Go away! You know what's funny? First time I came through here, I didn't get the meat. I went around to the left, right, without getting the meat. And then I came through there, and I was trying to loot those torches, and it wouldn't let me because I wasn't at the proper game mechanic spot, which is freaking nuts. There was no wolves there either. So. Mike? Is that you? Mike, what? wait! What the heck? Not sure what's going on there. Gotta get out of the cave, though. Go ahead and make myself hydrated. I'm out of the cave, man. What are you talking about? There we go. Uh, I am fully out of the... Oh, eat something small. Well, I'm still out of the cave. Move along. I don't think I've eaten anything small. I think the stuff I've eaten has been big, so... I don't know. What else? Oh, dude, I got out of the cave. Don't tell me this thing's, like, stuck. Oh, I guess you have to drop that into the water. No footprints. Where did he go? Got me. And now I'm soaked. I think I saw a drying line in the shelter. Wolf. Oh, that's right. When when you drop down out of the cave, you're right at the entrance, which is where the wolves were in the first place. Forgot about that. All right, let's get back to the to the shack. See if we can do something here. Oh, I'm beat. Yeah, you are. You've had a busy day. You had a very busy day. So we'll come up to the ice slide, hang, hang to the right, get back to the cabin, and see what's what. I'm definitely gonna need some sleep. I don't know I don't know if you can sleep anywhere in this game. You know, like in a lot of games you could just kind of sleep on the floor or whatever. I don't know if you can do that in this game. Come on. There we go. Yeah, but it's funny, I go into the cave, there's a bunch of wolves at the entrance. I come out of the cave. It loops around to the exact same spot as the entrance, but because I went so far through a cave, I don't realize that I'm at the entrance again. So I always have to deal with those freaking wolves. Yeah, that, that's not really there, bro. <laughs> You're getting confused here. What the hell's happening? Everything's gonna be fine. We'll eventually get there. Sure could use a blanket right now. This guy's all cold and stuff. Yeah, what's happening is my mental thing is making me see things that aren't there. I really need to eat something. Yeah, you do. Wait, what? You just say, hey, dude, you're forty percent. What are you what are you talking about? Oh, can I chop down some trees for wood? For firewood? Let's try. Yeah, I can. 
Come on. Why is it heart beating? Oh, because I'm tired. Alright, fine. So the game crashed when I was trying to sleep. So I reloaded, I came back, and I was like, I'm going to chop down this tree. So I chopped down the tree into a bunch of wood. We're going to... We're gonna go ahead and do that. Actually, just put all of it in there. Seems good to me. I'm right. gonna go ahead and light this. I'm gonna get something to drink. And then uh, that right there is a clothesline. And I can put all my clothes on there to dry out. Which is what I'm gonna do. So, drying line. And I don't think you, I don't think you could shift or... Oh, right click works. Good. And now we're gonna take a nap. Please don't, please don't crash on me. Please don't crash. I'd really appreciate it if you didn't crash. Maybe you didn't like me going to sleep with my, um, with my clothes on. I don't know. Uh, we're gonna sleep for four hours. Let's see how that goes. Cool. Now we just need to, uh, cook the deer, and then I'm probably gonna go to sleep again. Um, the hell? Fireplace. Oh, it went out. Great. Um, burn these sticks. 10 seconds. That's not going to be enough. 20 seconds is going to be enough either. At least I don't think so. Food. Alright. I'm going to have to go out and chop down some stuff. Oops. Uh, right click, right click. Now, is that just automatically on now? I think that stuff is automatically on. So, what we're going to do is... We're going to eat something just to keep us going. We've got some stuff here to eat. There we go. And I'm going to chop down another tree. We're going to light the fire. We're going to cook the uh, deer meat. Yeah, you can't just hold. Wait, it says hold to swing. But you can't hold to swing. You got to. Oh, I got sap. All right, cool. Yeah, you can't just hold to swing. You got to keep pressing the button. I like it when games allow me to just hold to swing. I'm not going to lie, but that's okay. I won't hold it against the game. Seems like we're doing all right. As soon as that falls, it's going to just pop into firewood. There it goes. I'm wondering if I didn't even pick up all the firewood from the last tree. Anything around here? Doesn't look like it. You do have a well, which is nice. Although it doesn't seem like I can really interact with it. Alright, close the door. Start the fire. Can I just, um... Oh, you can just right-click. Cool. Light it up. And now we're going to cook some food. Awesome. Awesome. Now, this food is really going to fill me up. Like, the other food's pretty good, but this is, like, real deal, like, big-time food. It's not like one of those games where you kill a deer, and then you have enough food for, like, four hours, and then you're hungry again, because that's not, you know, realistic in any sense of the way. In any sense of the... I don't know what the... I don't know how to finish that sentence. <laughs> By any stretch of the imagination, how about that? We'll go with that. Um, but then again, it's a video game and they're looking for balance, so I get it. I get it. Alright, let's eat that meat. That's what I'm talking about. Probably crossed that bridge. I wasn't ready before. But now maybe I want to get up there. On the other hand, Mike. I saw him. I can make a huge campfire. Try to get his attention. Oh, here we go. So do we want to cross the bridge or make the big campfire? I'm going to make the big campfire. I'll try to build the campfire. Maybe Mike or even Joel will see it and come find me. Tall order. Build the big campfire. Oh, that's pretty far. I think I'm going to get one more night's sleep before we go out and try and do that. Just let's get that let's get that sleep meter full. I'm thinking four hours is about half full, so we're gonna go with six hours. Just to make sure. Holy fuck. And that's the end of the demo. 
did you guys see the thing, the person in the top right hand side of the screen when that when that bear was attacking? What the heck was that? Let me know in the comments because I don't really know what the heck that is. Maybe it's just me going crazy. I don't know. But, you know, I'm really excited for this game uh, to come out. The demo was pretty fun. The prologue, whatever you want to call it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Um, you know, any kind of tips or anything. I'm not going to be do not going to be playing it again until it comes out. But still, if I missed anything really important, let me know because I'd be really curious. If you guys know what was in the top right hand side of that screen, let me know because I that was creepy AF. So anyway, guys, if you, if you ew, let me try that again. Anyway, guys, if you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.